Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to cancel deposit on Robinhood application. So first of all, of course, you would like to go and actually download the Robinhood application through Play Store, of course, if you have an Android, App Store, if you're using an iPhone or any other store you could be possibly using. Then you'd like to go and actually sign up to create your account. Of course, if it's your first time using the application, you will need to sign up, as I said. If you already have an account, just log in into your account and let's just get straight into the tutorial. So here, I'm just going to go and open my Ubuntu application, as you should, of course, if you want to follow this tutorial steps. So as you can see, they are actually asking me to enter a PIN code. So if it's your first time opening the application, they'll not ask you to do anything. But the second time you open the application, they will actually ask you to set a PIN code. Then start using this PIN code whenever you went or you go or you open the application. So for me, my PIN code is just here for zeros. And as you can see, they will actually takes me now into my main or the home screen. So here, uh, I, I should actually verify your account and add funds to my account and use the Robinhood application in the USA through real life or through v VPN. Of course, you'll find out how to do all of that in one of our videos in this channel. So once you've done all of that, you'll have the full access or the full options on your account. And you will be able to do several other stuff. Not like me because I didn't add funds to my account, so you'll not have the full options. So if you want actually to cancel deposits, all you need to do is just go and click at your account at the bottom right corner. Then click at the settings option at the top right corner. So here, if you have the full options, you'll find an option in the settings here called history. So all you need to do, just go and click on that, tap the pending deposit you want to cancel. Then you'll have an option there called cancel the transfer and you'll be actually good to go. So that's all be actually for the tutorial. I hope you guys like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.